Oh, and we are back like a sugar snack. Say what's up to me down below. Tell me your scent of the day down below. I got another little comparison video for you guys today. We're gonna be looking at Frank, spelled the fancy way, Olivier, Paris, Blue Touch. Apparently, it's an Aqua de Gio clone. And I don't have a current bottle of Aqua de Gio, so I got a sample, so we can have the current formulation here, ready to go. And we're gonna smell both of them. So if that sounds like a good idea, hit that like button, and let's lock into it. Now, this is gonna be my second Aqua de Gio clone. The first one was an Aqua de Gio Profomo clone, and it was Latifa Sucrat, and I absolutely love this one. To me, this is a super banger if you like this DNA, the Aqua de Gio family. But in that $20 range, wow, I was really impressed. So from this, I wanted to try more Aqua de Gio clones, and here we are. This is actually my first Frank Spelled the Fancy Way Olivier product, and there's a bunch more, and if this one's good, then maybe we'll try some more. Apparently, this is Aqua de Gio, but stronger, like pretty much 95%, if not all the way there, just stronger than the current formulation, because apparently this current formulation is for the dogs. It's weak as nothing. This box is looking a little banged up here. I wonder if this was a little return or something here. Let's see if the atomizer sprays right away. All right, well, this bottle's nice, though. Uh, it's Oh, all right, a decent little pop off that cap, nothing too impressive. This glass though, it's, it's all right, it's all right. We'll give a first impression of this guy first, and then we'll put the Aqua de Gio on, and we'll go back and forth for a second. Only time, it's gonna be the first time. All right, well, it didn't spray immediately, so makes me think maybe it's brand new. I kind of drenched myself in it, Jesus. I mean, it was only like two and a half sprays. Oh yeah, why, come on. Instantly in the flipping 90s. What? What? I'm getting ready for some school dance smelling this. Yeah, because I don't think, I never had a bottle of Aqua de Gio, but I think my dad did. I think he did. He didn't have Tommy, but I think he had this. Well, not this, obviously. He had Aqua de Gio. Oh, yeah. I just put like a whole palmful of dippity do whatever it was called, gel, all up in my hair. It's, I'm slicking it back, thinking it looks good, but it probably looks ridiculous. Ridiculous. I remember my hair used to get so hard. I feel like you used to be able to just crack it in half and the little gel flakes would like flake off It was so hard. I used to put so much of that little dippity doo gel or whatever it was called Anyways, that's immediately the vibe I'm getting from this like I'm about to go to somewhere fun in the 90s A little all-you-could-eat pizza place or something somewhere that I'm excited to be as a little kid Now let's get Aqua de Gio on then we'll go look at the notes. Where's the little atomizer? All right, here it is All right, there it is. Aqua de Gio. All right Huh, what? All right, I'm gonna let them dry down for a second. All right, we got citrus, green, aromatic, musky, woody, ozonic, fresh, aquatic, and sweet. Launched in 2011. All right, lemon, bergamot, chacom. Ah, oh, bergamot, we might as well get married at this point. I see you every day. Green notes, oh, green notes, okay. Tangerine, I don't know if tangerine's been in anything I've smelled yet. Pink pepper, all right, middle notes, is melon. Which, which type of melon? There's lots of melons. Patchouli, the woody notes, vetiver, sage, and galbanum. Yeah, I still don't know what galbanum is. Base notes are musk, amber, and oak moss. All right, sounds all very manly and everything here. All right, damn, I don't know how I'm gonna cut this into the video because I basically already filmed the whole flipping video. It's been 17 minutes, and I just realized that this is the EDP. This one came out in 2022. It's not the classic EDT. And I made a whole video going back and forth, smelling them, being like, yeah, they don't really smell exactly the same, blah, 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 blah. And now I know why. Because the EDP is a little bit different, to be honest with you. Yeah, the DNA is definitely the same. This is definitely a little bit different. And as a standalone scent, now that uh, this is basically the first time I've ever smelled Aqua de Gio EDP, well, actually, I like it. It smells pretty good. I'm digging this. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to wear this sample. I didn't give it a wearing because I just thought it was Aqua de Gio that I've smelled a million times. But it's not. It's the new EDP. Is it exactly? Blue Touch? No, Blue Touch is the original EDT. So they're definitely a little bit different. I'm gonna put the notes up for you. Blue Touch here, the EDP here, and the EDT right here so we can see all of them. Overall, for in the low $20 range, if you want an Aqua de Gio alternative, I really want it to go side by side. I'm sorry guys that I bought the wrong one, but I, I remember the Aqua de Gio family and between the EDP sample, the Profomo clone, and now Blue Touch over here, I think we're definitely getting the gist of what the Aqua de Gio scent profile is. So I feel it pretty confident saying this is at least 90 to 95 percent the way to aqua de Gio old school edt compared to the edp no the edp is a little different this has a little something different we're gonna have to come back to this on a different day but i like it but i'm actually liking this frank spelled the fancy way blue touch a little bit better i really do maybe i just like regular aqua de Gio edt percent profile more than i'm liking this edp off the first rip maybe my nose hasn't calibrated yet i'm still in the 90s in love with blue touch slash aqua de Gio edt but overall yeah, I'm really liking this. I think it's a great pickup. Let me know down below what other Frank Spelled the Fancy Ways Olivier have you guys tried. Hope you guys are good. Hit that like button, subscribe, and I love you. Bye for now.